Okay, and would you believe it? This is the last level of the game. And let's equip the sling, since it's a good weapon. Oh, and we have uh, pterodactyls, pteranodons, or something here. I think those are also a one-hit kill, or at least almost. Yep. I mean, look at that. The game didn't even bother to make the health in the battle decrease. And we can nicely uh, dispose of the local tribals or cavemen or whatever with the sling, and we'll pick up those small rocks, which I think are supposed to be gold or something. Oh, whoa. Okay, that's not going well at all. So on the other hand, it's not very, oh, I mean, terribly damaging either. Mm -mm. Oh, why not? Let's switch to the gun for a while. Very similar to other projectile weapons, so you don't have to hold the fire button down and press a direction, but just holding the fire button down, or just pressing the fire button is enough to make you shoot. And this is a bit tricky due to how little space you have to maneuver in. Look, it's messy! Or something. <coughs> Now for this you need to sling. Actually, let's see what happens if you try to pick. Ah, oh, okay. Off with his head once again. Now, yeah, you make the, the steepest upward shot you can with the sling to blow up the head. Which looks a bit weird. Makes it look like that lizard was made of green rock. The way it blew apart with no blood. Okay, ah, yeah, another flying lizard. A screen. Okay, I think we are uh, getting close to looping the area over. Yep, here we are. Now we'll head back to that cave opening we passed by. And we are running dangerously low on water here. And of course we can't pick up the water from that lake there. Now that's just... that would just be silly. Okay, going here. Um, let's see if we can run past that guy. Uh, no. Okay, there we go. Come on, can we make it before the water runs out? Okay, now we come here and there's the monkey. Just punch it and it'll go back. So if you haven't... Uh, <coughs> Oh, just made it in time. If we had picked up the flaming orb in the previous level, that monkey would stay there, so it's possible to glitch it out of the way by dying in that screen, which as seen previously, when you die in the screen, all the enemies will disappear, and the monkey is sort of an enemy. And yeah, this is, I guess, the second spot in the game to get water, or actually. Well, you can get water from multiple cacti in the first level, but anyway. However, do not try to take water from this fountain, since you'll die. Apparently it's poisoned. Or something. Okay, now we are in the actual temple, I guess. And I suppose those are 
voracious flesh-eating ants or something since it'll rapidly drain your health. Now to get rid of them, sneak over here and you will uh, lose an upon them. Uh, I don't know what that is supposed to be. An ant lion? A giant spider? <coughs> anyway, let it sweep over the floor and um, insects are gone. And for our troubles we get some kind of yellow thing. Maybe it's supposed to be some kind of idol. It looks like a big flower to me for whatever reason. Okay, what's up here? Nothing really over here. And here we have a sea moth, a carnivorous plant. Which can also kill you in one hit. Ah, but, uh, let's show that also. Yep. Is it just me or are they getting a bit lazy about with the killing methods here? They're all just one swipe and it's off with your head. And if I can position myself correctly we can pick up the plank here. <coughs> Come on now. Oh, should I try from this side? There we go. And over here we have... Um, what's that? A chisel maybe? And um, I'm supposed to punch that to pick it up. Oh yeah, I'm thinking we got a chisel and a hammer. Okay, now fill up onto water. Now, hmm, um, altar with three indentations or something. And, uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's see, what should we use? I think it's either the chisel or. Or is it the hammer? Okay. And here we have the final idol or something. Now you can time this just right to pick it up without getting mauled by the mummy. Now nah, let's do it like this just to check how you spawn. Okay. That's how you pick it up. Oh, or if you are just at the right distance, you can stay out of the mummy's reach and pick it up. Now, let's see how was this. Yeah, you can place these things down here. And I don't remember at all what the uh, combination is, but hey, there's only six possibilities. Three times two times one. Um. Okay, it's not that. So let's try. This? Oh, goody! Got it on the second try. And just to be on the safe side. One more drink for the road. Now, well, we have a chasm here and no jumping mechanic, but it seems obvious what we are supposed to do here. Yep. And run. And what have we here? A theater tottering scale. What tries if we just try to run past it? Hmm, it won't let us. Now, ah, what do we have that might be put on a scale? Why, we have heavy yellow stones. So let's try that, if I can. Okay. 
And now, what do we find in here? Well, first of all, it's another loading pause. <coughs> but this shouldn't take long. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I might as well let you listen <coughs> listen to the loading screen music um loading music while while we are in here. Yeah, that didn't take long. Congratulations, you have fulfilled your destiny! Yeah, we found the elephant burial ground or something, which I Apparently was indoors in some ancient temple. Huh. Never would have imagined that. And well, that's it for this game. We won! Hooray! Hmm. Yeah, and apparently the destiny is well fulfilling to play a character life's work of the player character's father or something. I never quite understood that, understood that bit. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is one of those ending screens which you can't get out of uh, without resetting the computer or something. Wait a minute, is this the same music that I was playing in the first level. I guess this time I won't let this run without me talking like I did with did with Myth. I'm sure this was playing uh, in the background of some level. Anyway, this has been Let's Play Tusker for the Commodore 64, another fine system 3 game, though not as quite as fun as some as some of the others they have done in my opinion, but still fun though pretty short. But hey, catch you again with the next game. <laughs>